to learn parts of speech. What is a part of speech? A part of speech is a category into which one places a word depending on how it functions in a sentence. So the part of a sentence, each and every part, is a part of speech. There are eight parts of speech, noun, pronoun, adjective, verb, adverb, preposition, conjunction, and interjection. First, let us see what is noun. A noun is a word that is used to name a person, place, thing, or idea. We can say a noun is a naming word. Example, Sita is a nice girl. The cow is a four-footed animal. Sita and girl, they are noun. Cow, animal, they are also noun. Then pronoun. Pronoun is a word that is used instead of noun. He is the most intelligent boy in our class. Instead of saying, naming the person as Rahul or someone else, we can call as he. It is used instead of the noun. It is a nice idea. So he, she, it, they, we, you, those are pronouns. Then adjective. An adjective is a word that is used to modify. Describe or make more definite a noun or pronoun. For example, she is a good girl. We are describing her, right? Good girl. We are describing the noun. This is a great idea. They are adjectives. Then comes verb. So, verb is a word that is used to express an action or a state of being. We can say verb is an action word. She is a girl. State of being is told here. She sings well. An action. My mother is cooking. An action again. Then comes adverb. An adverb is a word that is used to modify a verb, an adjective or another adverb. So, do remember, when we talk about adjective, it modifies noun and pronoun. But adverb, it modifies adjective and verb or another adverb. She sings well. So, what is it is talking about well? So, it is talking about the action sings. How does she sing? But if we talk about adjective, we have the question, how is she? She is good. But in adverb, we have the question, how does she sing? So, she sings well. How does he walk? He walks slowly. We are talking about the action, the quality of the action. They are very energetic. However, their energy is their very energetic page. So it is that that modify verb, adjective, or another adverb. I hope you have understood. Have you? Then comes preposition. Preposition is a word that is used to show the relationship of a noun or pronoun to some other word in the sentence. For example, the book is on the table. We are, here we get to know about the position. Then the vegetables are there in the CRISPR. I hope you all know what CRISPR is. Then comes conjunction. Conjunction is a word that is used to join words or groups of words. We can call them adjoining words. She is beautiful and intelligent. Instead of saying she is beautiful, she is intelligent. In two sentences we can say she is beautiful and intelligent. I could not go there because I was ill. I could not go there full stop, I was ill. Instead of saying two sentences, we say, I could not go there because I was ill and because they are conjunction. Then comes the last one, interjection. The words that express the emotion, sudden expressions. Interjection a word is a word that is used to express emotion. It has no grammatical relation to the rest of the sentence. Hooray, we own the maths. Hooray is the interjection. And there is always an exclamation mark. Alas, we lost it. So we have learned all the eight. And what are they actually? All the eight parts of speech. Okay. Thank you very much.